Hey guys, in this video, I'm gonna go over both how you can reset the Windows drive on your computer, and this is probably gonna be the C drive, and then also how you can clean out other storage devices that are hooked up to your computer. So for resetting our Windows C drive, what we're gonna do is right click on our Windows icon on our taskbar, and then we're gonna click on settings. In our settings in this search bar, we're gonna type in reset this PC, and it should show up in this drop down menu, and we can click on that. And you have a couple of different options here. Most of you guys are probably going to choose the reset this PC option. So this is for your PC. If it's not running well, you can reset it. It might help. This will let you choose to keep your personal files or remove them. And then it reinstalls Windows. If you click on get started, you'll have the option to either keep your files. So this is going to remove apps and settings, but keep your personal files or you can remove everything. It'll remove all of your personal files, apps and settings when resetting the PC. So you can select your option there and then continue to work your way through the menus until you go through the process of resetting your PC. Now, something I also want to mention is that you shouldn't have your PC going into sleep mode during this process. So to check on this, again, we're going to right click on the Windows icon here on our taskbar and click on settings. And then in our settings, we're going to search for sleep and then click on power and sleep settings. And you want to make sure that your screen does not turn off or go into sleep. So I have both of these selected on never. This is important because when you're going through the reset process, if your computer goes to sleep or turns off, it can interrupt that process. You have to start back again from the beginning. So that's how you're going to go about resetting the C drive, the Windows drive on your computer. Now, if you want to clean out a storage device such as an SSD or a USB, you can do that as well. And we can see these different drives if we right click on our Windows icon down here on our taskbar and we can click on disk management. And we can see that these are our different disks and what is on them. To make sure that you have the right disk that you want to clean out, you can always right click on it and then click on properties. And it should give you the brand of the device. So for me, I know that I want to clean out my Crucial SSD. It says Crucial right here as the brand name. So I know that's the right one. Also, you can potentially tell by the size on the disk. So I know that that SSD has about 500 gigabytes of storage, whereas the main C drive has about a terabyte and the USB stick that I have plugged in has about 64 gigabytes. So all of those line up to about those numbers. Something I want to quickly mention, and it should go without saying, back up any files that you want to keep that's on this storage device. Otherwise, they will be cleaned out when we're going through this process. So anything that you want to keep, make sure you back it up. So now at this point to clean out that drive, I'm going to right click on the Windows icon on the taskbar and click on run. And then in this area, I'm going to type in disk part. So D-I-S-K-P-A-R-T and then click enter. So just to double check to make sure that I have the proper disk that I'm going to be cleaning out, I'm going to type in list disk. And this is going to list the different disks. And I can tell that disk one is the one that I want to clean out. So I'm going to type in select disk one and then click enter. It says disk one is now the selected disk. And at this point to clean it out, all I have to do is type in clean and click enter. And that's all you have to do. So it says it succeeded in cleaning the disk. And I can see that here in my disk management, I now have 489 gigabytes unallocated. So going back over to my this PC and I can see in my devices and drives that it's no longer showing up that SSD. And that's because I need to reformat it and initialize it. So to do this, I'm going to go back to my disk management, right click on that disk and then click on where it says initialize disk and then click OK. Then right click right here on your unallocated storage and click on where it says new simple volume. This opens up the new simple volume wizard. We're going to click next. You can specify the volume size, but automatically here it's selecting the maximum disk space allowed. So I'm going to have that and then click next. And I'm going to assign it to the D disk drive like it was before and click next. Performing a quick format and then clicking next. And you can double check over everything, but it should all look good. And then we can click finish at the bottom. And I can see that my SSD has now been reformatted and initialized and going back to my this PC under devices and drives. It's now showing up here on the D drive. I can rename this if I want. I'm going to call this crucial SSD. So now that's the name of the storage device that I've hooked up to my D drive. And if I open it up, I can see that there's nothing in here. So I hope this video was helpful going over how you can clean out or reset the different drives that are on your computer. I appreciate you guys stopping by. Consider subscribing to the YouTube channel and I'll see you back here next time.